Hi. <laughs> Go ahead. I'll be here. I'm Nina. This I'm is Jesse. <laughs> this is the panic button. Today we're reacting to Would You Date a Transgender? Hood versus College Town. Would you personally date a transgender person? Yes. Yeah. Yes. No. 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 Yeah. And why is that? I'm heterosexual. Would you date a transgender person? First we're gonna ask Georgetown and then we're gonna ask the hood. Either of you guys date a transgender? Yeah, no. I would. Yes. And have you ever done it? No. Yeah, I'm already in a relationship. Is it a transgender relationship? No, it's not. Would you date a transgender person? <laughs> Would you date a transgender person? I'm already in a relationship, so <laughs> null and void. You can't ask me. Listen, I'm locked out. <laughs> majority of I'm going to say 98 percent of the people who said that they would are only saying that, knowing that they're bullshitting. Well, you know that woman was just like I wouldn't, so I'm just going to say I'm in a relationship. Actually, <laughs> great relationship. Such such <laughs> liars. Like, and you could see it. You could see it. There's no way you would be taking if you're a straight woman that you're going to no, take. No, they're bi. If they say yes, they're bi. They're bi. They're bi. So they'll. They'll date a, a dude who's dressed yeah. and looks like a woman. Yeah. Bullshit. Yeah. yeah. They Bull would. They would. Shit. They Bullshit. probably. They'd they, fuck yeah. them. They once. would. What? They would out of fear? They would out of guilt? Curiosity. College girls? Yes. The trial years. <laughs> I, I don't because agree. It's the most expensive I, free trial of anything you'll have. Well, then how come they, they haven't? They said they would, but none of them have. Well, I think that they're just. Saying it for that's saying like, That's it? like a woman saying she's a lesbian. Have you ever dated a woman? No. What? It's like that one chick I know who sat there and sucked every guy's dick in town and then was like, Hey guys, hey Facebook, I'm gay, I'm a lesbian. I just really like dick. Then two months later started dating some dude. I think a lot of them are bi-identifying. And so they hear transgender and they're like, I'm so supportive, I would date them. And then you realize that like once you're actually in it, I it ain't what it. you expected. I don't want it. No, they'll never say that. They'll just ghost them and be like, oh, I just got busy with schoolwork. I don't see why not. I don't think it's, like, that big of a deal. Would you personally date a transgender person? No, I wouldn't. No. Would you date a transgender? No, no I'm a transgender, not like me. A man that's dressed as a woman would make me appear to be a lesbian in public, but I'm heterosexual. I wouldn't date a woman that's dressed as a man because then that is being a lesbian and I'm not a lesbian, so. Why don't you want to? I mean, I'm straight, bro. Like, I like females, right. real females, you feel what I'm saying? <laughs> so if you're dating a transgender person and you're straight at the time, does, does that mean you're straight after you date them? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I think you're still straight. Like you're a guy and you're dating a trans girl. Yeah. I think you're still yeah. straight. Cause also so, <laughs> so, so if a dude opens his mouth and receives a penis, girl he's dick. still straight. Okay. That penis is a girl's so, vagina. You be respectful, so. man. You're gonna be respectful, compliant, and appreciative. <laughs> so, so what you're saying, ma'am, is that you eat pussy? <laughs> is this how you eat pussy? <laughs> <laughs> I guess to them, that's what eating pussy is. <laughs> this, oh, oh. <laughs> it's just like eating pussy. Oh. <laughs> it's just like it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah these, pussy. these people are in college. See, college is for stupid people. Eating. I went to college. College is for stupid people. I didn't now, go to college. Now, now college is like the dumbest of the dumb. Literally. They could see something right in their face, right? Something's like right in front of them. Yeah, and then someone else could be like, oh, that's not happening. And they're like, oh, it's not. No, it's not. <laughs> Welcome to college. Uh -huh. Yeah. Well, I'm slapping you in the face, but it is not happening. It is not happening. <laughs> it's not actually just all. like for one of your courses. So just like calm down. <laughs> I'm going to ask you, have you ever had a woman's pussy hit you in the uvula? Because like... <laughs> Wait, what did you just say? <laughs> How does that work? <laughs> oh, well, I guess it does nowadays. <laughs> These straight college women will tell you how it is. Sorry, a pansexual, whatever the fuck they are. Sometimes it's just hard to tell. You're still straight even if you're dating a transgender person? Yes, I guess because it's your own sexuality and I guess it doesn't really matter in regard to who you're dating as long as it's what you are. Wh when do we reach that point where you're no longer straight? Like, a Sexuality is different than wait, what wait, the wait. fuck you identify What as. the fuck was that sentence? Her, I need her. <laughs> She had Because also sometimes it's just hard to tell. You're still straight even if you're dating a transgender person? Yes, I guess because it's your own sexuality and I guess it doesn't really matter in regard to who you're dating as long as it's what you are. Your sexuality has everything to do with who you're dating and who you're having sex with, you I don't think it really matters because as long as your sexuality is what you say it is, then you could be that sexuality. But if you're not doing it, then you could be whatever sexuality you want to be. What they need to do is they need to have a, 
a lesbian, a tried and true lesbian who is right there, just able to be like, uh-uh, no. <laughs> Listen, I thought that one, the one chick, the black chick was a lesbian at first, and then she was like, nah, I'm straight, and I don't want to be looked at like I'm gay, because I'm straight. And I was like, preach, honey. Ain't nothing wrong with that. I'm, Not a damn thing. I'm gay. People assume I'm straight, so I get it. I, pre I, I appreciate that mentality. But do you break down and cry when people don't see that you're not straight? No, I just tell all the guys as soon as they start hitting on me, I got a girlfriend, bro. I'm super gay. There you go. <laughs> when, when do we reach that point where you're no longer straight? Like, okay, let's say you're a male, but then you're with someone who was a woman but transitioned into a male, then I guess, like, you would be like gay two then. two people who identify as the same gender. Right. So now it's not about sexuality; it's about identifying. Wait, wait. So you just, you just, you just recreated what what gay and lesbian is. Is is the, gay? The straight bitches did. Is gay trans oh. woman? Sorry, is gay man with trans man, or is gay man with man? That completely erases what we've been saying all along about how we're born gay. Because apparently now, according to the smart people of college... You can manufacture that shit in a lab. You can identify as it. Oh, you don't even have to go to the lab. You, you <laughs> no. 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 No, see, we're not born gay, according to the college people. You can identify as gay and just be it, apparently. This apparently, is so crazy. two women who are having sex could be two gay men. Let me or just, a straight couple. Let me just say, I know I've said this before, and I'll say it again until people get the fuck in their head. I was raised by very Christian people. I was told it's just an urge I'm giving into. I was told these things. So them telling me I could choose to be straight and not gay is what you're telling me right now? They came full circle. It took my mom damn near seven years to even be able to acknowledge me as a human. These are the new Christians. <laughs> and this is, these are the people that are apparently in my acronym. Or supporting our acronym, and yet saying the same shit Christians say, just in a different way. Patriarchy tried and true. Yeah. Okay, so it's all by identity, not necessarily by biology in that, in that, ex in that respect, right? Exactly, yeah. Okay. People are telling us that you could date a transgender person and still be gender person and still be straight. Does that make sense to you? No, that don't make sense because they changed their gender. So technically, you're still not straight. You're changing your gender for that person. No, because they're not originally a girl. I wouldn't say that you still be straight. You think that's something else at that point? Yeah, it's something else. You got, might have to make up something. It don't make sense. It just, how you straight, but you didn't. I guess because they changed their gender, but like it still don't make sense. Right. Because you were born your way. Can't still be straight and, and do that. I don't. I don't see how that can be. That doesn't make any sense to you. People say that. People say that. Yeah. Why do you think some people are hesitant to date a transgender? With a lot of religion, people want to say that it's their only personal belief. They don't understand that it's just how people are, and like being transgender doesn't mean that. Okay. You're bad. Like, you're just a person. Like, that's how you are. That's how you're born. There's a lot of unknown, you know, and that, like, really freaks people out. Probably just scared to get judged if they're dating a transgender. Like, oh, then people are going to think I'm gay. Yeah. Or... Why do you think people wouldn't want to date a transgender person? They're transphobic and homophobic. Okay. <laughs> Probably that they just don't understand. Why do you think some people don't want to date transgenders? So these stupid people think... It's fear. <laughs> ...that because I'm a lesbian... I, I'm a lesbian and I will not date a trans person because I'm afraid, uneducated, and I'm homophobic. Or your religion. And transphobic and I'm religious. Wow, do they have lesbians pegged wrong. Wow. <laughs> pegged. Because <laughs> that's what happens when a lesbian's with a non-man. Well, it's a choice. Some people don't want to date men. Mm -hmm. Some people don't want to date women. Why exactly do you not want to? Cause I'm not into them, but I, they're cool. I will hang with them, but personally, I, I'm not doing it. Dating, not doing it. I won't say nothing about nobody's personal opinion. If you like transgenders, that's fine, because I got gay friends, lesbian friends. Like, it's just up to you. So do you think a lot of this is education-based? Yeah, I think, like, if we start young, we could definitely, like, what? teach children to be more accepting and more loving of everyone of different yes. identities. Like, so Dude, you're, like, literally manipulating little kids into, want into like, thinking they have to have sex with trans people. What you don't understand. This completely, like, erases them growing up to be lesbian or gay. Like, you're trying to, like, fuck with children's sexual orientations and Would genders. You, these, Ooh, makes me mad. These kids are the trophy generation mm -hmm. where everyone got a medal, no matter oh, what. For and so, And so these people believe that if everyone just gets treated so lovingly, 
and we expose them to everything, then we did our job. But that's not your job. You shouldn't be able to sit there and tell kids about trans stuff. Ew. They're pulling down our acronym. Our acronym. Our community. Like a fucking... Like the Hindenburg. Okay? It's exploding. It's gonna fall. It's gonna crush people on the, on the floor. You know? On the ground. Kaboomy. And they're like, yay! <laughs> We're on fire! This is great! <laughs> oh my... See? I'm so stressed right now. I'm so frustrated with this. Fuck. You wanna finish? Yeah, yeah. Aren't starting like kindergarten, preschool? Yeah, I think so. Just showing like different families and different identities, how people feel about their identity and in their own skin is okay. really helpful. Why do you think some people wouldn't date a transgender person? I think a lot of people are uncomfortable with things that they... Well, if she's not educated on pussy, then maybe she should eat some, and then she'll find out if she's a lesbian. I love the fake-ass cross around her neck, because she ain't no Christian. <laughs> Most retarded I people I have ever seen. Uh, are not educated on. Uh, we don't talk about it enough, and so a lot of people don't know how... Yeah. It's all over the place. If she considers herself a Christian and a straight woman, then maybe she just hasn't been informed enough about vagina and lesbians. Maybe she's a lesbian. Maybe we just need to force her head in between a bitch's legs to find out if she's a lesbian. By her logic, let's do it. Yeah. They're pretty much saying, hey, you're a lesbian, right? Yeah. Well, the reason that you don't like dick has something to do with not being informed enough. Doesn't that sound familiar? Hmm, where have I heard that from before? It's Christians. This, they're scared because it's different to them and they don't like to go beyond their bubbles. I think a lot of people just don't understand and there's like a lot of fear mongering. So what they do know is, is like very, a very limited perspective or is from a very particular lens. People are scared of what they don't know about and they're just uneducated and they don't make the effort. And they don't make the effort. Let me tell you what I do know about. I've been there. I was left leaning. I was all about it. And you know, life experience, talking to people, understanding yourself will get you there real quick. You're telling me, as someone who's literally even tried to be in a relationship like that, that now that I wouldn't date someone like that again, I'm transphobic, I'm not educated, I don't know what their struggle is. I know more than you know, probably. But you guys wanna just blame it on education. How's that money doing? Going to good use? I got nothing to say to educate themselves. Yeah, and how do you think we change that? Is that something we would like go to the schools? I think we could introduce more education in the schools and like things like health classes, but I think a lot of places are really against that, just are against like sex ed and all that in general. So it's hard, but I think the schools would be a good place to start. It requires some education to like move past that in, in order to like challenge the belief that you hold. It, you know, it might be a true belief, but it's like that belief is informed by information that if they were to be educated about or were to seek more information about, it might challenge that belief itself. Some people that we spoke to said that the reason people wouldn't want to date a transgender person is because of education. Do you agree with that? I'm gonna say no, because that's not the way I go. You would never change your feelings, right? No. Do you think that, like, we should be trying to educate people to change their feelings? Mm, if you want to, and if they are open to hear it. So you don't think you can teach someone feelings? You can teach people feelings, but people, not everybody gonna accept how you feel. Do you guys think there's any other reason that someone wouldn't want to date a transgender person? I'm sure there's, like, a lot of personal beliefs one would hold. Personally, I think that those beliefs are, like, backed up by information that's unsupported. Um, I... I our beliefs are, but wait, so my belief that I'm a lesbian is backed up by things that aren't supported. This is like grooming 101. You gotta make them feel bad and that they're misinformed. Like okay? they're stupid. Like they're stupid. And by not considering them as like a dating prospect, it'll make you a horrible person if you're not con considering dating them. So you just need to be re-educated. Your personal beliefs, I'm not religious. Well, you do have personal beliefs that you know, you learned when you were younger, and we need to we need to eradicate that from your brain and start anew. Start you the religion Jesus of the left. Christ, it's fucking a, it's a fucking cult. It's like a cult. It's a cult. I won't but do the it. only people that you're manipulating and are, are able to manipulate to sleep with people they don't want to sleep with are the people who are mentally and morally fucking weak. Mm-hmm. And most people are weak these days. Yeah. So you're pretty much just taking advantage of people that don't know any better. You want to keep going? Then that's She's about pathetic. to tell us what she identifies oh, Jesus as. Jesus Christ.
supported. Um, I identify as straight, unfortunately, but I feel like I would be open to it for sure. Unfortunately, I'm not special, I'm not important. I'm just a plain old straight person. <laughs> That's unfortunate. That I'm straight? <laughs> it's not the vibe these days. Do you guys date a transgender? Uh, actually, uh, no. no. Not really, yeah, I'm not really. Why not? I believe this is not uh, normal. Mm -hmm. This is not normal thing yeah. to change from female to male or male to female because God, Allah, created us in a specific way. So why would we change that? Where are y'all from? From Saudi Arabia. Do you believe being a lesbian or being a straight person or a gay person is just a misinformed state of mind? Will you not date trans people because of personal beliefs or is there a little bit more to it? Is it because you were not informed as a child? Do you think we need to teach children about sexual orientation and gender identity? Do you think the L, Gs, and the Bs should detach from the T, Q, etc.? Let us know in the comments below.